pro ball life is you know definitely different than the college life you know as far as like just knowing that this is a job now you know you, you have to take care of yourself it's your career obviously still playing to win like I was five years old playing the same game so it's not nothing different from that aspect but I think just keep it in the back of your mind you know your development is going to get you to where you want to go and you just have to realize like everything you do on and off the field is going to impact you uh, either positively or negatively on the field, I think there's a lot of things. Being able to be on time for the v the velo, I think the velo has gotten a lot better. You know, everyone here has you know better stuff, and just being able to recognize pitches a lot earlier than I probably was in college, and uh, just being more efficient with my movements too. You know, whether that be in the weight room or in the outfield, or being lighter on my feet, being able to be more mobile. Um, you know, I've worked really hard. I have you know super tight hips, so I've been able to you know kind of open those up with Aaron in the weight room, and he's showed me a few. Uh, exercises and I think that's you know ultimately translated over to you know in-game scenarios so for me it's yeah I would say it has been eye-opening I always had a decent approach I think I think you can get away with a little bit um, especially at a younger age obviously here in professional baseball pitchers are a lot better right so they're going to try to pitch around the zone rather than just giving you what you want. But when they do give you what you want or when they make that mistake pitch, then we have to capitalize on that. And that's really what we talk about. It's uh, dominating the zone.